Welcome to Video Land. Mega High! Wake up, Kid Icarus. Welcome to Castle Day! It's Congo Land! Behold, the ultimate warp zone. Kevin, I thought I told you to clean up your room. In the last episode of Captain N, the Game Master, Mother Brain's obsession to conquer Video Land led her to a startling discovery. That toy mirror on my wall? Tell me how to crush them once and for all! Hidden within Mount Icarus's towering peak, the three sacred treasures contain the power you seek. Fueled by her mad craving for power, Mother Brain devised a clever plan to hold a Video Olympics at Mount Icarus Coliseum with Captain N and his N team versus Mother Brain's villains. Kevin and the others were led to believe that the games would finally bring peace to Video Land, while in truth, the Video Olympics was a trick devised by Mother Brain to get the three sacred treasures so she could destroy the N team once and for all. Deadly warp zone to oblivion. Something tells me we're about to have a nightmare on Mother Brain Street. It's the mega center of our universe, where all warp zones intersect. Which one of these warpicus zones did we come out of? I don't know, but the wrong one could take us to any of a hundred deadly fates. Be cool, guys. This is your captain speaking, and I've got an idea how to find the way home. Simon, have you got any rope in that backpack of yours? No, but I've got some fishing line. Perfect. We'll have a better chance of finding the way back if we each take a different warp zone. Whoever finds the right one, just give a tug on the line. Affirmative. Eeny, meeny, miny, mocus. This is the warp zone into which I go again. You're next, Simon. Don't be silly. I want to make sure both of you get off safely. Well, that's very thoughtful of you, Simon. Whoa! Good luck. Who needs luck when you have brains? I'll just hang out here until I feel a pull in my line, and I won't have to risk my handsome neck. Oh, on the other hand, why worry about a neck when you've got an entire body to think of? Whoa! This doesn't look so bad. But that does! This must be the Colosseum! This is Yankee Stadium! Mount Icarus! I'm home, I guess! I found it! Where 
Where's everybody? We've only been gone a few minutes. That's true for us, your highness. But my mega sensors indicate a week has passed on Mount Icarus. One of those warp zones must have been a time warp. Then Mother Brains had free reign over Videoland for a week. Why? I'll find out there's worse places to be than Mount Mother Brain! Mount Mother Brain? You've got to help us! King Hippo and the Eggplant Wizard have taken over our world! And Dr. Wily took the three sacred treasures to Megaland to conquer that world as well! Megaland? That's my home! We've got to warp there mega fast! But nothing can stop the power of the three sacred treasures! I can, your Heineckus! <laughs> you? Impossible! With fire arrows, the sacred bow, and the protective crystal, I'm most certainly Catechus. But you'll have to get past Medusa to get them. It's gonna be dangerous, Maximus, but I must try. Kevin and I will go with Mega Man and see if we can slow down Dr. Wily until you and Simon get the power items we need. But Medusa's even uglier than Mother Brain. One look at her face turns a man to stone. Look on the bright side, Simon. You'd make a very handsome statue. Oh, yes, I would, wouldn't I? Simon and Kid Icarus head for Medusa's palace. Captain N and the others warp off to Megaland. Mega Man! I'm so glad you could come. And you must be Captain N. I've heard a great deal about you. <gasps> You're the dude who built all those wicked robots. Gutsman, Iceman, Alekman. And don't forget Fireman, Gutsman, and Bomb Man. They were all quite useful, you know, until Dr. Wily reprogrammed them for his destructive ends. And now he's back again, and using the power of the three sacred treasures to take over our world. Don't worry, Doctor, right? The Mega Man game is my specialty. I'll zap Dr. Wily into Warp Factor 10. You'll have to make it past all six deadly robots to get to him. I've been working on a new robot that may be able to help you. I call him Garbage Man. He's programmed to trash the other robots. Watch. No! Stop! Stop! My computer, you trashy! Uh, thanks, Doc, but no thanks. We'll handle the situation ourselves. Stop, you miserable heat! Not that! Oh, that's my laser welding machine! The mega warp to the first robot is over here. Uh, you might want to wait here, Princess. These mega battles can get pretty hairy. My father trained me to fight for freedom, Captain N. I can take care of myself. Uh, uh who's arguing? We'll challenge Katzman first! Whoa! That was some kind of drop! Hurry! The bladers will be here any second! They can't hurt me. Oh. But each time we get hit, we lose power. Oh, that was incredible. I can hardly believe we made it all the way through. We haven't. You mean there's more? We've only got a little energy left. 
We're almost there. All we have to do is get past Big Eye. After what we've been through, an eye doesn't sound like such a big deal. It's not the eye I'm worried about. It's what's attached to it! Now go! Our zappers aren't cutting it! We don't have enough mega power! We only got one energy unit left. One more hit and we're finished. Ah! Oh! We're alive! What happened? We got the boot from old Big Eye. You mean we have to go all the way through again? That's nothing. When I first played the game, I went through it 50 times before I got to Cutsman. I'm afraid this isn't the same as your game, Captain N. What do you mean? What I think he means is if we get trashed two more times, we're going to the big trash dump in the sky. We must hurry! It's deja vu time, guys. Here we go again! As Captain N and the others make another attempt to get to the deadly Cutsman, Simon and Kid Icarus make their way toward a rendezvous with Medusa. Grow to enjoy ruling this world for Mother Brain, eh, Iggy? Well, you said it, King Hippo. There's nothing like a hot tub and steam to make a guy feel like a new eggplant. They're blocking the entrance to Medusa's warp zone. Just leave everything to Simon Belmont, master of disguise. Hey! You must be the steam bath repairman. This bath isn't hot enough. I'm barely sweating. Ah, uh, yes. Well, we'll have it fixed for you in a jiffy, won't we, Shrimpicus? Whatever you say, Dopius Maximus. Hold this. <laughs> Laying down on the job, huh? Tell me when it's steamy enough for you. What's that? Still too cold? Meanwhile, back in Megaland, Captain N and the others have made it back through the deadly Cutsman maze. Sort of like an electric cheeseburger, huh? It's Big Eye again! Be careful, Kevin. If he flattens us, we're through. Don't worry, Princess. I got to be Game Master by learning from my mistakes. Trash Masher, try to squash me! I dare you! You are magnificent, Kevin! Uh, you really think so? There's no time to waste! We've got to mega move it! Well, I wouldn't call hugging a princess a waste of time. When I open the door, we've got to run. Ready?
cutting's my game, and I don't mean hair. <laughs> <laughs> He's too powerful. We can't stop him. We can with a little help from man's best friend, Duco Boy. Remember how you love to bark and run circles around the gardener? <laughs> That's right. Guess what? He's the new gardener. Go get him! <laughs> Boy, Duke. Well, that wasn't so bad. You're right, Princess. Compared to the next five robots, Cutsman was just a wimp. Meanwhile, back on Mount Icarus, Simon Belmont and Kid Icarus approach Medusa's lair in search of the needed power items. What perfectly dreadful statues. Medusa has lousy taste in art. That's not Articus. They're warriors who looked at Medusa. Simonius, these are the three power items we're looking for. <laughs> Close your eyes, Icarus. What do you mean, don't look? How are we supposed to get the power items if we can't look where we're going? We'll have to wear blinders. Take off your backpackers. I can't see! Good! I'll get the power items. You distracted this Medusa. But whatever you do, don't look at her. What am I? An idiot? <gasps> Excuse me. Hello there, handsome. Why don't you take those goggles off and Feast your eyes on me. <laughs> uh, you don't sound very ugly. I'm not ugly. Your little friend's just jealous that I'll fall for you instead of him. Why, that little sneak, wanting you all to himself. How about giving your handsome Simon a great big... out of shape. I feel kind of stiff. Never mind, Icarus. We've got to get these power items back to Mega Land. What? what? What happened? You've enlisted in the army against Mother Brain. As your commanding officer, I order you to free this world. As Simon and company warp off to Mega Land, Captain N and the others arrive at Dr. Wily's secret command center. been expecting you, Captain Ern. Congratulations on nearly destroying my deadly androids. But we did destroy them. I'm afraid not, Your Highness. You see, the three sacred treasures have given me unlimited power. I had more than enough to revive my little family. Destroy Captain N! We better make a mega retreat! So much for that idea! Oh man, what I wouldn't give to be able to press my reset button. Come 
want is here. Pulverize that stupid vampire hunter! Am I glad that worked? Kid Icarus, quick! Shoot the fire arrow at the three sacred treasures! Hey! Oh, Garnicus! The only fire arrow in a sniff! Not yet! Finish now, Captain N! He's going to ram us! Not if I have one word to say about it, and I do! Pause! A little mid-course correction should do the trick. Master.